Hello, I'm Michael Diamond, and you're watching Muscle Central. First thing I want you to do is subscribe and turn on those notifications. Now, uh, I was watching on another YouTube channel a video, and it was suggested that Flex Lewis left the 212 division because he was afraid he was going to lose to Derek Lunsford, he saw the writing on the wall, and rather than lose to Derek Lunsford, uh, he ran to the open division. I guess he, it's, he felt safer there. Now, uh, let's try to, to dissect this a little bit. Flex Lewis was a seven-time 212 Olympia champion. He wasn't just a seven-time 212 Olympia champion. He was a very dominant champion. I don't think there was ever a point when he was in danger uh, of losing the title. That's not knocking any of his competitors, any of the men he stepped on stage against. Was he stepped to get on stage against some great competitors? It's just a test to uh, Flex Lewis, uh, what he brings to the what he brings to the show. So he. Seven time totally dominated. And it's no secret that he was sucking down to make weight. And I would imagine as the years passed, it was getting even more difficult uh, to suck down. I don't think we've ever seen the best. Uh, Flex Lewis on stage the best Flex Lewis on stage wouldn't be uh, on a 212 stage I think that uh, held him back a little bit well anyway uh, back to the topic they stepped on the same stage on two occasions uh, on the Olympia stage. And although Derek Lundsford did place second to uh, Flex Lewis, Flex Lewis was never in any danger of losing a title. You can place second in the competition, but it could be a distant second. And, like I said, Flex Lewis was never in any danger uh, of losing the title, especially to Derek Lunsford, to suggest that Flex was scared of Derek, and that's why he ran to the open division. Derek, after Flex left, and the following year, Kamala Gardney. And then it was followed by Sean Clarita. And then, three years after the fact, Derek Lensford secured the title. Although, I might question it a little bit, but he's a champion nonetheless. So, if he was really nipping on, his heel, on Flex Lewis's heels... I would have imagined that he would have been the one that would have stepped right in and taken the top spot. Took him a little time to get there. Flex was not in any day, at any time, in any danger of losing the title, especially to Derek Lunsford. Uh, Derek Lunsford did not secure the title until. Uh, three years after Flex uh, left the uh, 212 division. And to think that he's in a 
be afraid of another 212 competitor, but run and jump into the waters with the big boys uh, in the open division where he's going to have guys uh, stature-wise a lot bigger than him and muscle-wise in many cases, a lot bigger than him. So to think that he j jumped out of the 212 into the open because he was afraid of another two, losing to another 212 competitor, that in itself does not make sense. The only thing we're waiting for now is to find out exactly what's going on with Flex and uh, Special Invitation. We know that he has gotten it before. Health issues, uh, and well, injuries that he needed to get addressed uh, did not uh, use that invite. So we didn't see him on the stage. Uh, it hasn't been officially announced, he will be getting an invite, he has every intention of competing again, he says everything is out of the way, everything is done, and he's ready to go, uh, we're waiting to hear what's going on with a special invitation, uh, I think it's really inevitable that he will get one, and uh, the only real concern I would have with Flex Lewis uh, stepping on stage in the open division uh, is the fact that he hasn't, it would be four years, come, the, come this Olympia, it would be four years that he hasn't stepped on the competitive stage. But we know he's trained throughout that period and, and kept himself uh, in shape. So uh, what's going to happen is yet to be seen. To conclude this video, Flex Lewis did not run from the 212 division because he was afraid to lose to Derek Lunsford. He dominated the division, and I just think got to the point where he didn't have nothing else to prove, and it became, as he got a little older, it became tougher and tougher to make the weight, and that's what it comes down to. <coughs> Excuse me. If you agree or disagree with anything I've said in this video, Please let me know in the comment section. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please share and by all means subscribe. Do not forget to hit the notification bell. This way, every time I put up a new video, you will be notified. Also, if you go to the description box, there are links there. One link is to the Facebook Muscle Central page. Any questions, you can go there, DM me. I'd be happy to answer them. Also, you're going to find links to Species Nutrition and Mr. G. Protein snacks, click on both links, go to both websites, check out all their great products. Once again, this is Michael Diamond, and I'd like to thank you for watching Muscle Central.